ordered a couple of diamond painting bookmarks. These are much smaller projects. I've enjoyed paint by numbers so much. I'm excited to try a diamond painting. Okay, the first bookmark set in the packet, this one is a peacock set. I really love the design of it and the kit comes with everything that we need. It has all of the diamonds, it has the glue, it even comes with its own tassels. This is a super simple craft because all of the diamond packages come numbered. You want to pick a number, empty it into this tray and then you have a pencil here. This is like a diamond picker upper pencil. You press it into the wax that's provided. This just makes it tacky enough so that you can pick up the diamonds very easily. Now you peel back the plastic protective sheet and underneath it the bookmark is sticky. So all we need to do is use the pencil to pick up a diamond and place it onto the correct number and you just press down gently. You don't have to do any kind of adhesion, anything. It adheres very easily. It is super easy and once you get the hang of it and once you know how to do it, it is super satisfying. The first two minutes you might just need to learn but after that you will just repeat as fast as you can. And once you finish your color you can just pour back all of the diamonds that are left over. There are two bookmarks in this pack so I'll come back to this color again when I use the second bookmark. And then just change the color. You keep opening the next package, pour it into the little tray and continue filling it in. And then you just keep changing your colors till you fill in the entire design. Honestly, this is more like playing with stickers and paint by numbers. It's a mix of both of it. But the diamonds are so beautiful. They're shiny. And I love that the peacock had all of these large diamonds included as well. The oval shaped ones. It just catches the light so much and it's very dramatic. Once I'm done, I like to just place the plastic on top and press down firmly all along the diamonds. Just to make sure everything's stuck in place firmly. And then I added the tassel and I loved how this one turned out. So the next set of bookmarks that I ordered is a pack of three bookmarks. These are all more mandala art kind of designs and they're all on a black background. And again, everything you need is included in the kit, so you can buy any set of these bookmarks by themselves. I also like that every one of them have tassels of their own. My daughter was excited to start and finish this bookmark, and I love the way the yellow contrasts against the black. This is a great activity for summer days when you have the kids at home. Something new, something fun for them to play with as well. I also like that the design on these bookmarks are free form and abstract so you can mix and match and choose whichever colors to put wherever you want. And here's how the finished bookmarks turned out. I loved all three of these. I think they take about 30 to 45 minutes each and I love that it's such a small project that you can start it and finish in one go. Another of the bookmarks that I ordered are these parrot design ones. I love this one especially the bright colors in this. Again, the kit comes with everything that you need, the diamonds, the pen, the tray, and also the tassels. This one is super colorful. It makes my rainbow heart very happy, and I totally love this project. So if you're looking for an afternoon project, this is a perfect craft. I actually pulled out these bookmarks, my daughter, my mom, everybody sat around the table, and we all had fun chatting and completing our own bookmarks. It's very simple once you figure out that you just need to stick the beads according to the numbers and you have so much fun relaxing. You can play music, watch a TV show if you want to, but best of all, there are a lot of giggles and a lot of stories shared. I enjoyed this and I hope today's video gave you some inspiration for crafting yourself. Let me know which one of these diamond painting bookmarks are your favorite. I love them all. And let me also know in the comments below if you are doing any other diamond painting. I have a large diamond painting that I've started that I'd love to find some inspiration to finish. So I'll see you in the comments. Happy crafting!